In this legal series, I am going to talk about Women Reservation Bill 2023. It is going to be tabled. It is going to be at the Sansa Pass in Lok Sabha. In join with opposition supports as well as the Zanzan ruling party will be in. It is definitely. There is no question about it. The bill will be passed in Rajya Sabha. It will give the assent of the other Sansa, the President of India. There is no question, no doubt about it. It is a long bending at the Sansa. The bill, it was first introduced during the region of Deva Gauda. When Deva Gauda, Prime Minister of India, the bill was introduced, it got failed. And after that, once again, it was tabled by the Vajbhai-led government that also faced the failure of the passing the bill. Subsequently, all the governments at the Sansandarli began to table with this little bit amendments and everything. For the first time, it is going to be junctioned because the ruling party has strong strength and whatever the Sasu opposition party is planning to do, the bill will be passed. It will, pass in, it will be passed in Lok Sabha and Rajya Sabha and subsequently it will get the assent. Nothing it. Nothing will be changed in it. But now in the Women Reservation Bill gives in the strength to the women, it gives 30% of the reservation. But the more inner reservation also are applicable for the and uh, uh, SCST people and the other people and the uh, everything. All will happen in the main reservation, in the subterranean also. But a 33% reservation will be encouraging the Sanskrit really in the main reservation. The male forces will be definitely affected. Will be definitely affected. No doubt, no doubt, doubt about it. But also whether it will be helpful or not that the combatant women have to decide. Whatever may be, the post should have the competent person. So as the government now has given through Bill 33% reservation, women community in India has more talented people and they are hidden. So they have to come out to the post of an important post and an important other sanction really provision and everything using this reservation. Mostly women, they hide themselves whereby their talents and everything are hidden. They are not going to be used. But now the Sansan, the really women should come forward using their talents and skills and their traits to give the service to the people. For example, if one person is appointed in government post under the reservation of the women reservation, they should express their, their competency. They should give their skills to the society, not only to their home, so it is a chance to them, it is a step to them to go forward, to go up high, to prove themselves through this bill. So India needs very competent person in all the sectors, including space sectors and administration sectors and also management sectors and economic sectors. In most sectors, the very talented women are needed. So they have to prove the competent person under the women reservation field. It's the most welcomable bill. 